Hello everyone, I hope you're all keeping safe and well. I'd like to introduce my new cruising series. I went out a couple of weeks ago. The series will comprise five episodes in total. Part of the reason for going out was to check the boat. I hadn't been out since October. I wanted to make sure that everything was functioning okay. And I'm pleased to say it was. The day I went out, the weather wasn't very good. It was rather overcast, but subsequent days I had some glorious weather. So it's something really to look forward to. I'm going to be discussing various boating aspects and showing some things that I don't think I've shown before. There will be a mix of cruising and chats. I know that many of you like to hear me chat away. <laughs> So I chat to you both inside the boat and outside. I think generally I was very pleased with how things went. We've had a miserable sort of winter, been very cold, the marina's been frozen and so forth. And it was really, really good to get out. It was a good chill out for me. I enjoyed it very, very much indeed. <laughs> so I hope you enjoy watching. Hi, and thanks for joining me. I'm just getting ready to cast off. I need to untie the front of the boat. I just put the rope on the top of the cratch board. Boat has swung out. <laughs> I'm just walking down the gunnels to get back. All right, well, I'm back. <laughs> I just need to untie on this end and I'll be away. I'm all done. So here we go. Backing up. The boat should start turning. It's got it. Getting there slowly. It's a very dull day today. I'm not going to be going far. I'm just straightening up now. That's the worst part over. Getting out of the mooring. But it's not very windy today. making my way to the exit it's not so easy to see it's masked by reeds just check in to see if any boats are coming from either direction can't see any always a little bit more difficult with the canopy on Slowed right down now. It's looking good. Hey, another successful exit. I meant to check, I can't recall when I was last out at the marina. <laughs> I think it was October and here we are in February. I see the swans ahead. I thought they were going to come on this side of the boat but they're going to pass on that side. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that.
here's the surprise, there's a boat coming down towards me. I have to beware my canopy. <laughs> it slows right down rather like I have. Hello. Hello. First boat of the day. <laughs> Just going under the willow tree. Straightening up for Skew Bridge. Big clump of grass in the back there. Didn't notice that when I came along. Mooring on the right here has been empty for quite some while. It's a CRT mooring, so I suppose they'll be looking for a new occupier. Just passing the boathouse on my right. This particular property was left to the Inland Waterways Association for them to let out so they could get an income from it. That was a few years back now. Just passing moored boats. There's a surprise, there's a boat behind me now. The front of the boat actually looks familiar to me, but I just can't think what boat it is. I'm convinced it wants to rain. <laughs> I'm hoping it won't though. That boat gets ever nearer. <laughs> That's okay. Just let that boat go by. Called Catherine. Just trying to make sure I don't get hung up on the edge here. Strange place to let a boat pass on a corner, but I could see pretty much round and I thought they'd get by going a lot quicker than I am. That's quite unusual actually, there are no boats moored up to Bridge 22 and normally there's something. So what I thought looked like a familiar boat when looking at it from the front turned out not to be. I passed a boat just now that was mooring up, it was putting its uh, canopy up at the back. They'd obviously finished for the day. And I'm very close to my destination now as well. I'm actually going to put my boots on in readiness for jumping off. To slow up a bit, I think. <laughs> I'm racing along there. Oh. Uh, it's, ne oh. it's never easy putting boots on. Uh. That's one on. 
<laughs> right, they're on. This cap is very loose fitting, which I like actually. It does slide around a bit. We're going to moor up here on the Armco. Gonna jump off now then. Oh. Need to get the fenders out. <laughs> Did you hear that? <laughs> oh well. Uh. Need to sort myself out. Just getting the fenders ready. That's one. Pull the boat back in. One. One's got itself rather tangled up. How did it do that? Well and truly knotted. <laughs> I don't believe this, it keeps knotting itself. It's not been used for such a long while. We're going to tilt up the solar panels, ready for the morning. These two don't tilt so far because of the, the board that's there. Good, that's done. Time to switch off the engine. <laughs> we'll just better record the figure. Right, got it. I always take a note of the figure, so I'll just jot that down while I think of it. And the time. I've been here a while sorting myself out. <laughs> time soon goes, doesn't it? It seems very strange being the only boat moored along here. In the summer, this is quite a popular spot because the sun is to my right and the boat will get the sun on one side, on its uh, starboard side, all day long as it arcs around. So it's quite a good position to be. But here I am on my lonesome. <laughs> but it can't be helped. You never know, someone else might come and join me. I'm going to put the kettle on, I think, now. Have a cup of tea. Whilst that's boiling, I'm going to get on and finish some of my outside jobs. A boat is actually moored up just behind me. So I'm not alone anymore.
Well, my heating's just coming on. <laughs> I don't want that on. <laughs> oh, I suppose I could leave it on for a little while. Just need to pop down the front windscreen. Is it a windscreen or a window? <laughs> these clips. That's got it. <laughs> Just pop the side down as well. Easier to come outside to do this. And for the time being I tend to leave the other side open. Kettle seems to be taking a long while boiling. Let's go and see what's happening. Still on the go. <laughs> It's so nice to be out again and for my treat I have some lemon drizzle cake. <laughs> I live well don't I? <laughs> mm, yummy! <laughs> Two boats pass before eight o'clock. I run the engine for half an hour in the morning to top up the batteries first thing. And also hopefully to put a little bit of heat into the hot water. It looks like another grey day. It's hot. <laughs> First cup of coffee of the day. I always like to have a wash and shower in the morning and when I'm out cruising I tend to boil the water in the kettle using the gas for my for my wash and then I shower and in the winter very often I've got the heating on it comes on for a short while in the morning which is helping maintain the hot water and I also run the engine for half an hour, normally at any time of year when I'm cruising, unless it's really bright sunshine and the batteries are well topped up. But at this time of year, I'd run the engine for half an hour just to give the batteries a bit of a top up. So all that has gone well. <laughs> I set I set a foyer afreshed <laughs> and about to have a banana. Look at that for a banana. <laughs> I've been eating bananas since I was pre-toddler, I think, because there are pictures of me when I'm about... 18 months old with with a banana in my hand so I've always loved bananas the trouble is that you buy them they're all at the same degree of ripeness they're either green waiting to ripen off or they're already ripening off and they go off so quickly so don't buy them as often as I should but here goes I'm going to enjoy this <laughs> it down with some coffee. So already today I've noticed two boats pass and I think another one came past when I was showering. You feel the boat move so it gives you an idea of what's going on. So I'm going to do some editing in a minute. <laughs> it's very miserable 
It's meant to be a sunny day. I'm hoping the sun will come out later. But for the time being, I'm just going to stay in the boat. Not sure if I'll move on today or not. I probably will nip out and move a little bit later on, I think. Well, look at that. The sun is coming out. These are tough if you don't roll them up tight enough. Will this one go in? Yeah, I'm just about. It's amazing how different everything feels when the sun shines. I'm going to leave this episode here and wish you all well. Hello! <laughs> A boat passing by. <laughs> so I was saying I was going to leave this episode here. I hope you've enjoyed watching. All that remains for me to say is look after yourselves, your friends and families. Take the utmost care. Until next time, bye for now.